You think that your friend's gonna die? He could. The way he eats that stuff all the time is maddening, damn it. Roll it here, and we're about to go action. Hi, my name is JT, and I'm addicted to ranch. Ever since I was little, I've always just enjoyed eating ranch. I don't know what it is about it. I'm not sure if it's its unique array of herbs and spices or its creamy mayonnaise texture, but something about it is I just couldn't stay away from. This sounds oddly sexual. Well, I like to think of it more of a uh, passion. When I was younger, this is when I first met my other mom, all right? So it was her, myself, my brother, and my father. We all went to Golden Corral, and, and this lady was holding up a huge batch of ranch, right? Just lifting it up as high as she could. And I guess she wasn't strong enough, so out of nowhere, she dropped it on me. And it was embarrassing, because you know how you just hear nothing but uh, silverware drop, and you can hear that clink, that all, like a bunch of, it just hit me at all at once. And you can just hear the whole restaurant go quiet, looking at me, just seeing what happened, right? So the girl was like, oh my God, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And you know me, I was like a nine-year-old, 11-year-old kid, just mad at the world. I was like, no, you did this on purpose. You meant to do this. Why would you do this to me? And I was like, I'm gonna sell this whole place. So <laughs> it wasn't until the manager came and he's like, yo, hey, hey, calm down, calm down. Here's a free uh, a coupon for an all you can eat. I was like, okay, bet, you know, you know, after that, I was happy. So next time I went there, I was like, hey, let me uh, use this coupon. And it was right after I ate it. And they were like, sir, this coupon's been expired for two months. <sighs> I mind you, so that coupon was already a month expired and then another month of me not knowing that it was expired so i was like dang they really played me for fools so yeah you know i've known jt for about what five to six years now and um yeah i've seen him put ranch with just about every single kind of thing you, you could think of you know I, i've seen him put it on chicken i've seen him put it on pizza i've seen him put it on fries i've seen him put it on onion rings i've seen him put it on again a buffalo chicken style pizza I see him put it on a vegetable medley while at dinner. You know, after workout, he'll have a plate of vegetables, plate of protein, very healthy, dows it with ranch. You know, and everybody will always say, hey man, I feel like, you know, you eat too much ranch. He'll say, hey, shut the hell up. So, you know, he always did where the heck he, he wanted to do, you know. Do I think that he's going to die from it? You know, I've always told him that, hey bro, too much of anything is bad for you. He said, well, too much of nothing is bad for you, so fuck off. So I said, you know, you're probably right, man. You're probably right. If he dies, I'm not gonna say I told him so, but I'll just tell him. Should you listen to me? Man. There's teriyaki on this, and there's ranch on this. He needs help. Somewhere deep down in my heart, I still love you. Somewhere deep down in my heart, I still love you. I still love in you. In my heart. I still love you. In my heart. I still love you.